Hello, I'm there. And welcome to Mermaid Swamp. A horror adventure game developed by Yuri. Let's begin. This game contains grotesque assault sexual images. Please, be mindful of this as you play. The author takes no responsibility and wants for any trouble or damages indirectly brought about by the game. What the... Am I underwater? What the hell am I doing? Somebody there? Rin, wake up! Stop sleeping already, for crying out loud. Uh, shut up. I was just taking a nap. That's so bad. One hell of a nap. Good has been driving all this time, and you've just been snoozing in the back. Sheesh. Not a hint of lady in this one. Not exactly an interest in being ladylike for an early balding punk like you. Rise and shine, Rin. I'm going to guess you slept well, given you started around noon. Yeah, but thanks to Baldi here, more of a rude awakening. Quit your jammering, Yamazaki. Hey, Yuta, where are we, anyway? You said something about kicking things into high gear, but are we in the mountains or what? <laughs> My bad. I don't know where this is either. Huh? You're telling me we're lost? Yep, don't tell me the first clue where we are. You gotta be kidding! You said the mountains were a shortcut, so I thought you knew the way. Sorry about that. I mean, I did kinda know at first, but the fog just got so thick. <laughs> that ain't funny, shrimp face! This is exactly why I didn't want to go on no trip in your lousy old GPS-less car. Oh, don't kick the seat. Well, now, what do we do? I can't even see any signs. Huh? Yuta, why did you stop? I didn't, it just stopped. Hold on, I'll try the engine. Oh, crap. I think it's totally busted. Are you for real, dude? You dumbass! Ah, uh, wait here. I'll go out and take a look. Let's have a look at the car then. Nothing looks wrong to me. Why the hell did it stop? I have no idea, ma'am. Can I check the tires or the back or anything? No? There's a rock here. A pretty interesting rock if you ask me. So Somebody there? Quite a surprise. What would you be doing up in these mountains, miss? Just an old coot. Damn it, don't freak me out. We were on a trip, but our car, car went kaput. So I guess we're stuck. That's very unfortunate. Is there anywhere you can stay? Nah. If we can't get it running, I guess we'll be spending the night in the car. You needn't do that. My home is nearby. You can stay there. Even if it's summer, it's quite cold in the night. Huh? For real? Well, let me talk to my buds. That's a relief. Thanks, old man. But you're sure. We don't want to pressure you. Well, I'm a landlord around here, you see. My house is much bigger than my needs. I would appreciate some young folks make use of it. I'm really grateful. We'll get the car fixed and leave tomorrow. Ah, I can see it now. Whoa! That place is huge! Damn, now that's a mansion! I kinda feel bad, Gramps, but thanks. Whoa. Whoa! It's a real room inside, too. You get to be rich, am I right? 
origin of the Beshedo of the state of his old place, perhaps. Come along, and I'll show you to your rooms. Will do, sir. You can use this room, Miss Rin. Forgive the old-fashionedness. It ain't nothing. I gotta like the whole retro thing. Test again, Gramps. I'm sure you're all hungry, aren't you? I'll cook you some dinner. Until then, make yourself at home. I like you. You're a nice old man. So, now what? What's in here? A chest for Volibus, maybe? There's nothing inside, though. Oh, that's pity. Let's have a look around this room. Perhaps there's something interesting here. Nothing inside. Really? Nope, nothing here either. Damn, this place is empty as hell. A fireplace. An electrical outlet. A large swamp. Can be seen in front of the house. Hmm. Nice bed, man. Well, there's nothing here. Let's leave this place now. Oh. I actually expected that door to be locked. For some weird reason. Hey there. You're the asshole, right? It ain't that old of a building, really. You see the other place out back? Now that's old! Huh? There's another mansion out back? The old man tells us that they built this one a generation ago. Since the other one was falling apart. Ha. Huh. Let's find the others. Guess I'm done here. Let's see now. Here. Oh, hey there, man. Hmm. I don't have much food on hand for guests. Would chicken and egg and rice be alright? Well, I'd kinda prefer something beefier. Like, literally beefier. Unfortunately, I'm out of beef. I must apologize. Oh well, I'll eat anything on this stomach. Or maybe on most stomachs. <laughs> alright. Hmm. Well, for now, I trust you. Ooh, what's this? Is that a mermaid? That's kinda expected though. A clock. Another fireplace, wait. What's in the trash can here? Oh, nothing. Hmm, what about this painting over here? Wait. This is the second time there's a picture of an... Picture of a woman. Nothing here. Wait, is this the bath tube? Damn. A washing machine. Okay. I know there are more of us here. But, oh, this is the toilet, never mind. But where are the others? Here, perhaps. There you are. Nice! Your room has a dresser! I ain't got one in mine. It's a great design, isn't it? You can come over to do your makeup in the morning. Hey, that's a bunch! Thank you, friend. I like you. Can I run in this game? No, I can't. Never mind, I can't run. Anything here? Nothing here. A TV. Another empty trash can. What's over here? Nothing. Ah! Blech. That was just disgusting, man. Yeah. Hey, Ren. You see that big swamp in front? Yeah. The one you can see out the windows. It's super huge, isn't it? Maybe I'll go swimming tomorrow. Yeah, uh... Stay away from me after you do that. Cause you're... Gonna reek. I wouldn't do that, man. I wouldn't do that. If you're gonna die because of that, then okay. Oh. Nothing new. Well, if you don't mind, sir, I'm gonna explore your little house here. Oh. Wait, what? Maybe I shouldn't walk around too much. Don't want Gramps to find me and get mad. Oh. Alright then. I think I've spoken to everyone here. Can I sleep now? Nope. 
Let's explore some more. It's locked. Well, oh, that's cool. What's in here? Hmm. Wait, this up. It's a phone. Phone here. Cool. Another TV. What's in here? Oh, it's just another way in. Cool. Why are the pictures of so many girls here? Oh, the old man must be a perv. Well, that works for me too. Wait, I've spoken to you. Okay. I'm done. I've pretty much done everything here right now. Are you done yet? You're not done yet. You need help with anything here. I can cook for you if you want. Uh, like here? No? You don't want any help. Never mind then. Ah. This is... Really... Interesting. I don't know what to do right now. Perhaps I should explore the other rooms. Or I could try to go outside. Oh. Wow. That's one big swamp. Hmm? What's this? A stone monument? Uh, a man did abduct from the seashore. Crap, I can't read this! Maybe Setaros know about this old stuff. He's got more knowledge than he knows what to do with. Pure is about the monument. Gah! Jeez, old man! You gotta not do that! Oh, I apologize. Did you read the inscription? Nah, couldn't make heads or tails of it. What's it say? It's a legend that's told around here. The legend of the so-called Mermaid Swamp. Legend? It originated in the middle of the Meiji era. My family has governed this area since Zarada time. It is said the son of a leader descended the mountains down to the seaside. I discovered a mermaid. Sounds shady right out of the gate. <laughs> well, it is a legend. The man was so smitten with the mermaid's beauty that they took her to his mountain home. He created a fish tank for her to live in, and he filled it with water from this very swamp. But the mermaid of the sea cares not for swamp water. The mermaid grew weak. I became quite ugly. Her clear skin swelled, her scales fell off, and her voice as melodic as ringing bells was reduced to a beastly howl. The mermaid took on her most repulsive form and subsequently died. And the mermaid's wrath is no petty thing. A young woman who vanished from the nearby village, it is said, to be the mermaid's curse. As such, this monument was put up to mourn her. What do you think? Hard to call it romantic, but interesting nonetheless, yes? Ah, uh, uh, sorry. Don't know all about, about all that. Tell it to Zetaro. He likes stories and stuff. Ah, is that right? Well, I've prepared dinner now, so come to the dining room if you could. Oh, finally! Let's get the move on! Mmm, delish! This is some great stuff, old man! I'm glad you like it. You can slow down a little, though. Ah, the bath is free if anyone wants to use it. You must be tired from the day's eve events. Please, rest yourselves. Yuka, you aren't gonna eat. What's up? Yeah, I guess I'm just too tired to have an appetite. Wow, you okay? We'll clean up and you can get to rest. Alright, thanks, Yuta. <coughs> yummy yummy! You'll clean up, no? Now? Why do we have to clean up after you? Do it yourself, yummyaki! Yeah. Work in your names while you're at it. 
Man, I'm stuffed. I'm ready to conk out of the bath. Wait, are we going to take a bath? Really? Ah, uh, nice fluffy bed. Mmm. Huh? Am I underwater again? Must be a dream. I mean, I'm not drowning, and my eyes don't hurt. Can't move a muscle though. Somebody's there again. Who the hell is it? Stop staring at me. I'll kill ya! Got some good sleep. Morning already. Ooh, I have a bad feeling about this already. Let's check out the other guys. Oh, freaking hell no. Are they gone? Please don't tell me they're gone. Oh, you're awake. Hey. Hey, Yuka, it's morning. Wake up. Sorry, Arin. I'm feeling kind of cold. Kind of rest a little longer. All right. You're gonna be okay. Don't push yourself, please. Yeah, I'm fine. Maybe I got a cold because of all that fog. Oh, Hey, I can make you some soup if you want, or noodles if you want that. Just ask, okay? And I'll be right back with it. Now. Wait, are, wait, are they outside? I think the guys might be outside. Now this picture here, this must be the dying mermaid, like seriously, I'm quite sure that's the dying mermaid, wait, perhaps the guys are in the kitchen, I will explore before I do something else, nope, pretty much empty, let's go outside then, they are not here, where the hell are they, like seriously, the swamp water is so murky, you can't see the bottom. Well, that's completely fine with me. Like seriously, where the hell are they? Wait, didn't you want to take a bath or something? Let's do that. Or take a shit or something. No? Never mind then. This is the bathroom. Here we go. Let's go. Let's take a bath. Or not. Ah, wash your clothes. Or no. Hmm. Like seriously. Where are the others? Oh! There you guys are. Dang! You guys are up early. What's the deal? Early? It's already 10. But anyway, I checked out the car. And it's still not looking any better. Couldn't be out of gas. It's so old. I wouldn't rule out it just falling apart. But whatever this, how are we gonna leave? Oh, what's happening here? So, yeah, old man. Sorry, but can we stay a while longer? That's unfortunate. As a matter of fact, I have to go to the nearby village to attend a memorial service for a few days. That's right. Well, we'll be out soon then. We wouldn't want to stay too long. Even without a car, we should find our way walking. We could just leave the car and take the train home. No, it's quite alright for you to stay. I'm the only one who lives here, after all. And I would quite appreciate someone looking after it. Huh, really? Indeed. And you wouldn't get far walking in the mountains. Certainly not in this fog. You're more than welcome to stay until your car is fixed. Just please, don't do anything dangerous like walk around the mountains. Alright, thanks Grams. Well, I'm going to be heading out. Keep an eye on any fires. And again, don't go walking in the mountains. Yeah, yeah, we'll hold down the fort. Don't you worry. Don't go dying yourself, you hear? <laughs> I'll be careful. So long. Why can't we just join you and take the train home? Hmm. Hey, it's evening already. 
I better get in the bath first. I hate going in after the guys. How come? Like, we're not bad or anything. Oh. Ah, oh, yeah. That's the good stuff. Couldn't really match the relax yesterday. And having a huge bath like this is sweet. Wonder if Yuka's gonna bath. Sucks that she's not feeling well. Kind of a waste of a trip. I'm getting sleepy. You're gonna have a dream again. Hmm? What's happened? What's going on? Yeah. Ah! The hell is this? The, the, the water's all gross. It was these colors when I got in. No, 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 not my fault, right? I'm not that dirty. Hey, what's the matter? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> My throat is so freaking dry right now that I can't even laugh properly. <laughs> okay, um, well, the hell are you bogging in on me for? <laughs> for real, though, this is. This is so funny. Just how, just how gross are you? Shut your mouth. That ain't the problem. The water just got, just got all muddy. Poof like that. All right. Jokes aside, then, isn't this swamp water, huh? And why would it be in the bath, genius? I don't know. Maybe the plumbing's screwed up. Could have mixed in some swamp water. Though the shower and toilet look okay. Well, no boss for a while, I guess. We'll have to hold out till the old man's back. I'm out. Hey, wait a minute. Damn it, what even? Ah, This pisses me off. I'll check on you, God, and get to bed. Hey. What about the monument? Like... Oh no. She's alive, right? You're alive? Please tell me you're alive. Yuka's trembling. Looks kinda pain. Is she gonna be okay? She probably will. She probably will. I really hope that. But you know... I... Why... There should be a sleep option here. Because... Hugs and stuff are good for people who are sick. Unless I get sick myself. That would just be bad. Well... I could prepare some stuff for her, like anything at all. Oh, a rice cooker. Yeah, I can make some rice for her and blend it in with something. Well, never mind then. Let's go to sleep. Ah, <sighs> let's go. Just remembered, my cell's out of battery. Better get it charging. Oh, let's go then. Better charge up my phone. Alright, that will do her. Bedtime. Good night. Ah. The dream again, or. I hear water again. I don't like this dream at all. Oh no! The. What in the fresh hell? The house is full of water! And what a weird one! Yeah, just dream. Wait, uh, what? I shouldn't touch my phone. The phone is charging. Can I run? Oh, no, I don't want this. Please, tell me I can just go back to sleep again. Please. <laughs> well, screw this man. Oh no. Oh no. What?
was there something there? It went toward Yuka's room. Before I go there, please tell me he's here. Where where the fuck are everyone? Everyone is gone. Like seriously. Oh no. Oh no. No 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 no. Mine. Mine. No. What? Eh, <laughs> just a dream. What an awful dream. I wonder if Yuka's up. I hope she's better. Oh no 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 she's gonna She's dead or something. Please tell me you join me, please. Hey morning, man, you look sleep as hell. Go wash your face, you dope. Wow. You are an asshole. Okay. Hey, Yuka, it's morning! Are you feeling any better? We can go to the hospital if it's bad, okay? Wait. Her face. Her face. Her face. Holy freaking... Yeah! Y y Yuka, what happened to you? You were swollen! Hey, what the hell? Yuka, what, what is this? Rin, call an ambulance. Uh, uh, ambulance? There's a phone in the living room, hurry! Get got, got it! Holy fuck, man! Living room, where's the living room? Here? Oh, there we go. Uh, uh, what's the number? Right, 119. Okay, go, go, go. What? Uh, uh, I don't hear, hear a thing. The wire's connected for sure. Is this thing busted? Piece of... This ain't the time. Oh yeah, my sister's trying to use that. Holy fucking hell, man. Oh man, I don't like this situation at all. This gives me the creeps. This gives me the creeps. Okay, come on, come on, come on. What? Out of battery? What? But it's plugged in. It's freaking charging, damn it! What the hell is going on? We can't call an avatar without a gun and working phone! No. Just what the hell happened to Yuka? Her body's all swollen. Skin all stiff. M makes her seem almost like a corpse. Shut the hell up! Yuka's sure as hell not dead! She's still breathing and all that! S sorry Hey. What about Setaro? Where'd he go? Oh no. He's off looking for nearby villages or towns. Or anywhere we can call a hospital. Villages? Towns? N no way there's any in walking distance. We didn't see any in the car, right? And there's no way in this fog. Can't see more than a few meters in front. You will leave Yuka how, how she is. You shut the hell up or I'll make you. S Setaro. How'd it go? No good. I can see a thing with a heavy fog. I feel lucky I even made it back. But you did look, right? Of course I did! But this fog just makes it impossible. I don't dare walk out there without signs. I mean, the old man was really insistent about us not walking around out there. I guess that's what he meant, huh? Well, well then what? You can might. What if she dies? I... I don't want that to happen. No, Yuka's fine. I don't think she'll die. Huh? That the truth. She's got a pulse, breathing, no fever. Nothing wrong other than the external stuff. Though, she keeps mumbling she's cold. Not that it's any reason to leave her. We've got to get her to a hospital soon. If we just ha had a map... We could get around. How about we look for one? Uh, Alright. I'm sure we'll find one if we work together. Hey, by the way, Setaro. About the phone not working, and the charger. Do you know why that happened? The house's power is out. Huh? Maybe it's an outage, or the guy forgot to pay his bill. Either way, power's out. You can see how dark it is without the lights, right? 
Yeah, it did seem dark, but why? It was working yesterday. How should I know? Still, Yuka takes priority right now. Got to find the map. Yeah, I got it. Let's search the house together. We... We gotta get Yuka help. Y yeah, right! We can do this, guys.